how Moscow engineered a smear campaign against Tim Waltz. Viral allegations of sexual abuse against the Democratic vice presidential candidate Tim Waltz were fabricated by Moscow, according to US authorities. It all started with this deep fake video showing a man claiming to be Waltz's former student, Matt Metro. He accuses Waltz of grooming and abusing him. Maybe if I'd come forward some 27 years ago, I could have prevented some other assaults. It turns out there was a Matt Metro who did attend the school where Waltz taught, but he was tracked down by the Washington Post and he firmly rejected the claim, saying the man in the video was not him. The video shows substantial evidence of AI manipulation. And while the content has now been flagged as false by online platforms, it did spread virally online and reached millions. A known Russian propagandist, John Duggan, has spread similar claims. He was joined on a podcast show by a man claiming to be from Kazakhstan and to have been abused by Walt while a foreign exchange student at his school in Mankato, Minnesota. That school told CBS News Channel that they had no record of any exchange student from Kazakhstan. So who's behind the claims? All clues lead to Moscow, according to US intelligence officials. They also warn interference from Russian, Chinese and Iranian groups could step up over the next days leading up to the US elections.